really smart. Send everybody out there. You got guts, right? You're trying to draw them off, draw them off sides. Take a timeout. Jump. There's no play. Just look at the body language. Oh, there is a play. Penny rolling out. Throws it. Hell! We'll see if he keeps that streak alive here. Nah, I'm, I'm just going to say he is. All right. Well, these are the type of plays that historically have gone against the Vikings. The Minneapolis Miracle. Plays that are fluke plays that went against this team. I'm sure Vikings fans are saying it's about time we get one of these plays to go our way. Him on the outside. He's going to come up and around the edge and collapse that corner. It's tough on these linebackers. And when they do that, it, it's awesome. And he's going to take off himself. He had no receivers downfield. And loose ball! Loose ball that is picked up by the Falcons. No, it's picked up by, after the loss, by Winston himself. This Broncos defense. He's got Kelsey. Third and four. Mahomes gets it complete for a first down to Demarcus Robinson. Short kick. It takes a bounce. That's a live ball. Call of the fly. And another Redskin touchdown. You're not allowed to advance that one, but it is going to be the Redskins football. As the rookie decaf Metcalf, DK Metcalf coughed it up. Play action. Bradford nearly fell down. The pass is caught, and it's a touchdown. Ahoa Mana now a Nui. And that's all you're getting from me. Nifty little route combination, trying to get some room for Fitzgerald, but Kendall Jenner's all, her fuller's all over this. Keep saying Jenner, I don't know why she's on my mind right now. He looks better. He looks sharp out here. 35. <laughs> That's on cue. Patrick <laughs> Chung hitting the wrist. It doesn't matter. He pulls another rabbit out of his head. Good protection. Looking down the field. And it is intercepted. And this is a frustrating loss, certainly, for the New England Patriots. Brady to the end zone. And Tompkins with a touchdown. He's on the edge protecting. But Ibukam, Ibukam. And is batted at the line. It's a news flash test. I, I, I get it, J.J. Watt batting balls, but guess what? They don't pay you as a defensive lineman to bat balls. He's got to get you the quarterback. Watch how smooth and in command he is of this offense. They began. It is intercepted to start the game. Brandon Whedon's going to be the quarterback of the Dallas Cowboys next week. So I know that'll be a big story. Oh, Matt Castle, they're going to go to him. No, they're not. It's hello. Here's Whedon loading up and firing an intercepted. They're chasing that running back as if it's Christian McCaffrey. They only need one guy to chase Bonifin, two guys to chase McCaffrey. That time, they're two guys on the wrong guy. It's the call. Up the middle, Bonifon. Reggie Bonifon off to the races. Are you kidding me? Reggie! And for the first time in four years, the Cowboys will have a winning record at the halfway point of this league. It says, come on in. Reaches over. Touchdown! Field position back at their five, and Theismann thrown from out of the end zone. That's six points! AFC with a chance to win the game here with a touchdown. Jarvis Landry stood up immediately by Keanu Reeves. Keanu Reeves, Keanu Neal. That would be something if Keanu Reeves was in the Pro Bowl. Coming on the year is Paulie Fricano. Fricano is six of eight now. Off the crossbar. He just barely had enough, but he knocked it through, Ben. Eastern Michigan answers. Three to three. Overcome his longest of the season for 46. He's got the foot. Got it. No. I'm just going to go out on a, a limb and say that this is uh, thus far in this young season, this is the biggest give up at bat. Oh, and rips one into right center field. Take your words back. So, Tim, where's he going now? Clearly out wide. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. 
shows what we know.